Hey guys, I'm Adam. I'm Ryan. And this is Two Neighbors. Ryan, what do we got going on today? All right guys, so one of my favorite Canadian shows of all time, I don't know how many times I've watched this start to finish, Trailer Park Boys, and we are doing the best of J-Rock. J to the R-O-C. Yeah, oh. yeah, yeah. <laughs> now, who is J-Rock? Jonathan Torrance. Used Jonathan. to be the host, another Canadian show, Jonovision. Yeah. Um, very, very funny, and uh, I, I thought he was a great character on Trailer Park, Trailer Park Boys. Um, yeah, so we're gonna check out a little bit of the J to the ROC. Do you, do you know what he's up to now? I have no idea. So he does a podcast with Jeremy Tiger, who is the drummer for Our Lady Peace. Oh, really? And they talk about all okay. things Canadiana. So, okay. Yeah, cool. it's uh, uh, Taggart and Torrance. Very cool. Yeah, is that how I say his last name? Yeah, Jonathan Torrance. Yeah. Torrance, yeah. So Taggart and Torrance, check it out. Good, uh, good little podcast. Um, so yeah, I'm excited. Uh, guys, before we start, please, if you're new to the channel, subscribe to the channel, Two Neighbors. It takes two seconds of your time, and we do appreciate it. And don't forget to turn on that little bell for notifications because we post content every single day. And we'd love to introduce you to our sponsor, OKSwag.com. Punch in Two Neighbors in the coupon code at checkout, and you'll receive 20% off plus free shipping, and pay no tax on some sweet Canadian swag like we're featuring here today. Um, free shipping anywhere in Canada and the U.S. A. <laughs> All right, Brian, All right, let's, let's do it. Let's watch some trailer J-Rock. Some oh, microphone, microphone assassin. <laughs> we're saving up some Skrilla right now to shoot a video, you know what I'm saying? So we're gonna shoot on this little motherfucker right here. The whole and TV camera. This time a negative arm, which uh, creatively, now me is kind of a comment on where we're at, you know what I'm saying? Like reversing the black and the white and who's black and who's white. And we're saying, you know what I'm saying? Society, you know what's up. This shit don't even matter, you know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, right? Yeah, yeah. I'm J-Rock, you know what I'm saying? J to the R-O-C up in this. This here's my boy T, Tyro. This here, right. Mr. Green, and that hydro in the back. So what's going on? We doing all right. We be dope when a new NWA come out, you know what I'm saying? What's going on, J-Rock? Damn, you stink. You should put some old spices, some brood up in that motherfucker. Because <laughs> North American manning down Russian women, vice versa, and all that is kind of free trade and all that with porn, right? You know what I'm saying? So I'm directing this and I wrote it. It's called From Russia with the Love Bone. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Everybody walking on the face of the earth trying to judge a J Rock. You know what I'm saying? See what I'm saying? But I ain't shook because the fuckers trying to take me out and stuff. But they can, right? So young, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? Too many times. 80, 90 times. Once or twice is cool, but 80 or 90 times, man. What are you from the department of Gnome Sands? You taking the Gnome Census? You counting my Gnome Sands? <laughs> Eight or nine times? That's you know what I'm saying? I'm just trying to have a good time, you know what I'm saying? You're counting my normal sands. How much supposed to be myself when you're counting my normal sands all the time? You know what I'm saying? Saying what? You know what I'm saying? One, two, one, two. Is this shit on? What the hell is going on here? What's going on, love? What the hell is wrong so with you, Jamie? We some drinks and stuff like that, hanging out, got the camera going, it's all good. Ow, mom, that hurts, why are you playing me you like tell, that you Tell her to turn off the camera and get your friends the hell up to hell out of here. Yeah, yeah. Uh, okay. Hang on. J-Rock, with money. 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 Mom, in my hand. Money. 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 No turn table for two weeks. Ow, you're playing me like this in front of my friends. This is whack. Right. You talking about these car stereos? These is cassette decks, motherfucker. <laughs> this one ain't even cassette deck. It's a C motherfucking B. You're my brother, right? I'm gonna hook you up with all I can do, 50%. Check this shit out, boy. No sing. No sing. Right? Me and T know that when y'all was up in the Oz, you lost your honey wagon and shit. No sing. No sing. What are you doing? We're prepared to hook man? you up with this, ma, but 150 a month. 150 a month. No sing. No sing. Alright, now as for them car stereos, here's how it's gonna go down, you know what I'm saying? I'll get them punk ass bitches, Corey and Trevor, roll by your crib once I roll out and get the hydro gear with my motherfucking crew. Dog, I wish it was some other shit I could do, but the shit's been pimped tight, you understand? J-Rock, 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 you know rewind here for a minute, what are you talking about? T? I missed it, man. Just said Corey and Trevor's gonna swing by and drop off the hydro gear and business hasn't been that great. That's right. Green shirt, a white boy rolling around. He rolling around the city. He rolling around the town. He rolling on a bike with a banana seat. You dissing all the motherfuckers and hoes he meet. He rolling on a bike. He going to the 
do it. Ah, yeah. Listen, boys, this is the deal. I need some shrooms. What can you guys do for me? We'll get you some shrooms. We'll you, some shrooms. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. Wait, let me ask you something. How long you known the J Rock and the Rock Pile? You know what I'm saying? No. J Rock can get a motherfucker anything a motherfucker gonna ask for. Ain't that right, T? Anything. You know what I'm saying? All right, I need them within an hour. You guys do it? All right, dog. You this is important, back. boys, all right? All right. Come back in five minutes. I mean, now what are we gonna do with the other 55 minutes? You know what I'm saying? That's how fucking hard the rock pile is. Hard as fuck. You know what I'm saying? My mom's up in Moncton for two weeks. You're talking about throwing it down old school pimp tight. You know what I'm saying? We're opening tonight. Tonight? What you talking about, you boy? All right, you guys, let's go. You know what I'm saying? Rock pile. Get a turntable set up. Talking about bags of ice, bottles of liquor. Oh, yeah! Welcome, y'all, to the dopest life. J Rock and the Rock. You know what I'm saying? Yo, the lights is burned on the trail park. Now, J Rock and the Rock Pile is proud to present our license crib. You know what I'm saying? Open for business, but boys down front throwing the shit down. Come on, come on. We're talking about busting the shit up. Come on, we open. Alright, J Rock's up the mic tonight. Let me see your hands up. We're doing it right. Hands up. Throw your hands up. Throw your hands up. <laughs> Throw your hands up! Throw your hands up! Throw your hands up! Oh yeah! You best step off, Randy, with your no shirt, lawn mow, and cheeseburger eating prick. <laughs> yeah, man, that was weak, man. Played yourself, suckers. Bubbles, you know some pile about kitties, you know what I'm saying? What's up, T? What's going on? Not much, J-Rock. You can stay here as long as you want with your candy, Bubbles. Stay in this van. J-Rock got your back hard, you know what I'm saying? Appreciate that, J. All right, here's what I'm talking about. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Bubbles is renting this van for $12 a month, you know what I'm saying? That makes this motherfucker an income property, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Once me and T get power and water going on, then this motherfucker's gonna fall under the same jurisdiction as every other trailer up in this ma, you know what I'm saying? So why don't you and that 15 cheeseburger eating Rico Suave looking motherfucker go on, because he ain't beating nobody. Peace. <laughs> Slayhee, man. Oh, rest in peace. He's a good actor. Can I get 15 half eaten cheeseburgers to go? You know what I'm saying? Order me something too, man. Hey, <laughs> there's something. Randy is a fashion police. You'd be in charge $500 for wearing them pants after Labor Day. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Slick pimp. Rock pile up in this mob. Jack, this digital cable shit, you know what I'm saying? J Rocks don't pay a cent of it, too. Peace. Yeah, man. 150 channels free, you can't go wrong, man. All the Mazoobies you can watch, boy. Peace. Okay, man. We out. Yeah, good hockey ain't tussle no way in the back. making no more porn movies, dog. Last time my mom went off on my head, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, I don't play that no more, Jules. Well, I got a budget for you. How does 800 bucks sound? 800 bucks? Why didn't you say the shit was professional, Jules? What are these things hanging in the trees, J-Rock? Bubbles ate the stick pimps, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> right, this here's the scene where the three lumberjacks come in, you know what I'm saying? Bubbles, you want to tie them witch hoes, you know what I'm saying? Yep. And get your freak on. And then Sam, y'all come in and say, no, hang on now, you ain't getting your freak on until I get paid, right? Because them your witch hoes, you know what I'm saying? Right, take the camera, right? Running through the woods, spin around, do all kinds of crazy shit. Do the Blair Witch process. Yeah. Yeah. Stuff, Blair you Witch house. Right? <laughs> Run around, act <laughs> crazy with the camera. Then you stop and you say, I ain't never been no frisky in my life. Yep. You know what I'm saying? You take this flashlight, right? Put it under your face, you know what I'm saying? Touch. You run and do it crazy. You, uh, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> right? so. You're scared, but you're frisky, right? Those eyes. The first CD out the Sunnyvale trailer park, you know what I'm saying? Except for that whack bullshit that Corey and Trevor released on cassette, but they were the front, you know what I'm saying? Man, I ain't changed since I started selling records, you know what I'm saying? I'm keeping it the fuck real, yo. You got degrees of black, you know what I'm saying? All kinds of different motherfuckers are, are a different kind of black, you know what I'm saying? T's right here, you know what I'm saying? And like Lionel Richie's right here because he ain't that black. Whichever you know what I'm saying, saying counter. <laughs> not black at all, you know what I'm saying? You got you Michael Jackson, who's like a white black, which, you know, can be sure in the whack. First of all, we need jack no tunes, you know what I'm saying? Me and T call it cross promotion, right? Because uh, putting Dr. Dre and Snoop Dogg and all my boys, the Detroit Velvet Smooth from Moncton, right? On the joint, you know what I'm saying? Moncton. We'll the motherfuckers and I'm going to call them up soon and say that we've done this, you know what I'm saying? But if they want to put a J-Rock joint on their desk, I ain't give a fuck. Jamie, how many 29-year-old record company presidents operate out of the mom's trailer? You know what I'm saying? 
Make it in this rap game. You know what I'm saying? Sling. Sling. Turn that shit off, motherfucker. I was getting changed. You know what I'm saying? I don't want that shit on TV. What do you I don't want, motherfucker? See me getting changed. Turn you know that thing off. He's pulling his gold. He's pulling his gold. He's getting changed, motherfucker. He's master. You know what I'm saying? You knocking motherfuckers. That was fucked. That was a bit fucked. <laughs> It wasn't that fuck, you know what I'm saying? I was getting chained. Peace, bum. Don't touch me. <laughs> <laughs> First of all, what motherfuckers don't understand about Jada that I will see right is that I'm into like method rap, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so I'm writing about rap. crime, you know what I'm saying? I gotta do crimes, you know what I'm saying? To get in that headspace, you know what I'm saying? So I was writing some vibes, some rhymes of like a sexual nature, right? So I was just getting myself in the sex vibe and some motherfuckers bust in and misinterpreted that, right? Thinking I was yanking my shit but that ain't even true you know what i'm saying i was just straight up writing some shit and from a, of a sexual place of a sexual nature right that's one of the rhymes right there you know what i'm saying i couldn't have written that unless i had my shit out right and some hand cream there ain't that <laughs> you know what i'm saying because we got to keep the shit on my mama's lawn because legal right and lady he and all that shit that bald headed kermit the frog with the motherfucker just fucking do this shit this here's a story about some shit that happened to me today. Check it out. Come on. Here we go. One, two, three. But now you heard the story about how I got caught. Cut. Playing with my shit. But hold that thought. Ooh. Before you disrespect J-R-O-C, it could happen to you. Because it happened to me. <laughs> Check this shit out. There's two things my fuckers gotta know about Jada the ROC, straight up, you know what I'm saying? First of all, I spin more rhymes than a lazy Susan, and I'm innocent until my guilt is proven. Peace. Represents <laughs> straight the fuck up. Jada the ROC. Jada the ROC, <laughs> very well done. I feel like everyone kind of knows a J-Rock in their life, yeah. you, know, you know, that kid in high school that just couldn't quite figure out, you know, how to represent himself, and it's like, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying, got that little style if you will the trailer park boys if you haven't seen it you have to watch it it well it started out at least as super low budget eventually you know their budget got a little better super low budget canadian like tv it and just blew up. the actors they got together in this were just so spot on um like really really good so yeah. like yeah like randy the, the big guy there yeah believe it or not for a number of years like in the show he always has his shirt off but while he's doing the show his real full-time job, he was a financial planner. So oh, like, really? yeah, he was actually a financial planner. So could you imagine like seeing him on the TV show oh, and then gosh. it's like, you're gonna go to like, <laughs> the last presenter that he won financial advice from, but no, he was. And so yeah, he worked as a financial advisor yeah. for many years, but it was a great show. And it was so, I don't know if it was well cast because they're like a lot of them are a group of friends. Um, Jonathan Torrance, uh, obviously, he was like probably the biggest well-known actor, I think at the I time. And, think, yeah. Um, but yeah, well done. Well show. Done blew up in the US and like, I mean, we're just coming, Canadians or Canadian content is coming out of Canada like left, right, and center right yeah. now with uh, all the info, like, I mean, Shit's Creek is from Canada, um, uh, Letter Kenny's from Canada, like so, you know, and the, just some great content coming out of Canada right now in the mainstream of uh, of television. So yeah, this, this definitely paved the way for a lot of shows. Yeah, so if you guys like this, guys, especially if you're Trailer Park Boys fans, Put some content down below that we can react to and we can watch. Um, yeah, hashtag my request along with the link to the Trailer Park Boys episode you want us to watch. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And uh, oh we will God, check it out. Counter. Yeah, we need a counter. We need someone. We need to hire someone just to do the counter. Um, but yeah, guys, check out OKSwag.com. Punch your two neighbors in the coupon code at checkout and you'll receive 20% off plus free shipping and pay no tax. on some sweet Canadian swag just like this. Uh, now shipping in Canada and the USA. Great for a little gift to anybody uh, that you think would uh, would like something like this. And uh, Ryan, what else should these lovely people do? All right, guys, if you haven't done so, like, share, and subscribe, guys. Please subscribe to the channel. It really helps, and we really do appreciate it. When you hit that subscribe button, make sure you turn on that little bell for notifications. We post new content every single day, and we don't want you to miss it. And if you have not done so, guys, check out Trailer Park Boys. It is awesome. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, know what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> That's it for our show today, guys. Thanks for joining us, and we will see you next time. Later, guys.